Hi, this is Sigira for Global Admission. And now, today, we're going to jump into a really interesting topic, which is all about Queenstown and studying. And why is it such a good place? Why so many people go there to study specifically uh, from all over the world and why you should too? I will give you five pretty big tips and reasons why you should be one of them. Where can you study and who can you become if you choose to go to New Zealand as so many in the world people do that. Trust me, I've been there, I tried it all. It's amazing and truly, truly lovely place to be in. And even if like you choose to study there, right? So you have two options that you can choose from. One is called a QRC, a first university where you can become everything around tourism industry and I will quote what kind of diplomas you can receive just so you know. Uh, so the first one hospitality management, second one adventure tourism management, sounds really exciting I know, and tourism and hospitality management. So one interesting thing is that in New Zealand as well and overall in the world uh, there is a really really high demand into these positions, right? It's uh, it's not just you study something and then you don't know what to do with this diploma. Not at all. If you go and choose this university afterwards, you definitely know. Like there is a demand. You can actually get a job and you can actually start into bringing the money that you are looking for for your wealth for your future. The second option that we have in Queenstown, New Zealand is called Southern Institute of Technology. So a little bit different and they, you can become, if you choose to study there, you can become someone in construction, which is again very popular specifically in New Zealand. I can tell you everyone is trying to build something, everyone is doing something. So that's one thing. Another one is hair and beauty. So a little bit different, but again, I mean, I even tried it for a little bit. I really did enjoy it. And another one, it's uh, information technologies, right? So you get a diploma in this field. And I think if you get a diploma in this field and you truly enjoy this process of uh, working, at your computer a lot of hours then this is something that you can always monetize this still for sure and it's very valuable as you go out there and travel even more to any country you probably will be able to find a job uh, no questions about that yes there will be a job for you in New Zealand a well-paid one hundred percent you will say but hey Sigita while I study there right it's very simple so by the government you can work for 20 hours a week to earn some income while you study and the good part is that every single employer pretty much every single one that I've worked for in New Zealand that I've experienced they're very welcoming when it comes to the students because they want to support their community definitely 20 hours per week is what is allowed by the law that you can work for company while you are doing your studies as studying in New Zealand Queenstown uh, you will notice that this city is absolutely stunning so it comes with a lot of perks that you can enjoy while living in Queenstown and that is why I highly recommend you choose not Auckland, not Christchurch or not any other smaller town or city that is in New Zealand you pick the best one which is Queenstown and you start studying there but it also what this city comes with right that's a very good question I think because before I visited the first time I had no idea I never even in my wildest dreams thought that it will be so good and why it's so good because when you go to a new country you'll feel like oh I won't have any friends I will I will maybe be alone especially if you choose to go alone but in Queenstown that's not the case I mean everyone is so friendly like this city is just full of adventure and full of opportunities just go out there meet people because everyone is really so stress-free so chill it is unbelievable only yeah because like if you have never been to Queenstown and you choose maybe to just go ahead and look at it and then see if you want to study there I want to say that you 100% will stay but go ahead it's your decision visit and see for yourself about the living side and actual practical side of the city of Queenstown in New Zealand I can say that it is pretty much 
like you're going into probably that's what I'm assuming you will do because most of the tourists and most of the people that choose to study in Queenstown start over there if you're not a local you go and you rent one room in a shared house it's absolutely normal I know in a lot of European places like that's not something that you do you don't share a house with random people in New Zealand that's absolutely a different story so you would be paying for your own room then you will probably have an amazing living room to share because most of the houses are really beautiful with magnificent view and over there so yeah you will have a shared kitchen as well so you will probably be paying a rent every single week uh, to the landlord uh, officially of course and so everything is very doable as well public transport is a very uh, efficient I have to say uh, it pretty much runs every 15 minutes my uh, biggest tip is to definitely if you choose to study in Queenstown as per this video because this is a truly great video am I right I thought so so I think you should be living in Fernhill or in Frenton or in Queenstown Central don't live farther than that it might get a little bit cheaper if you choose to live farther like Arrowtown or something like that but it's too far away you will just be annoyed by how much time you could be saving on the way to the school and back keep in mind these three areas and stay over there perks of Queenstown as city when living there it's so simple like Queenstown offers it all literally like you think about it and they will be happy to provide it so uh, they will have skydiving mountain biking hiking cinemas shopping centers swimming pool very well equipped by the way also a lot of gym options so you can stay on top of your health during the COVID they started to do this a very interesting thing where main gyms would offer also like live trainings online so you can even do your workouts from the comfort of your home I loved it I really loved it I enjoyed it and I think you will too as well uh, Queenstown is one of the most popular cities in the whole New Zealand so you will see a lot of people coming in and going out but that just keeps the town very fresh like fresh in terms of everyone will be smiling on the street it's very very good kind of a reminder about why we are on this planet and why we go and choose to study abroad it's because we want to meet new people it's because we want to learn new skills as well when you will have school holidays you will be able to go and explore the whole New Zealand and New Zealand is definitely one of the most beautiful countries I've ever been to so far my country list uh, is at number 22 uh, so 22 countries I've been to so far uh, definitely I would highly recommend and you should go there so make sure that you click subscribe you like this video if you want more of these ones coming out feel free if you have any questions about Queenstown studying over there even maybe in general like in New Zealand feel free to leave a comment I will make sure that we get back to you and you have the most wonderful day of this month see ya